What's going on guys, Will here back with another car video. Um, I'm really enjoying these at the moment and today we haven't got a modification or customization video. It's something slightly different that I want to start doing, start trying maybe. Um, so yeah, we'll get ahead and go right into it. So today, what I'm going to be doing is trialing a product that people have said is really good. Um, I have never used it, I haven't watched any reviews online, it's just what my friends have told me. So um, yeah, we're going to try it out. Basically, I'll explain the situation. So I've got a couple of scratches on my car. Now these were caused by just like my jean buttons, just scratching against the car when we're getting out of tight spaces, just little wear and tear things like that. So instead of using like a touch up pen to get rid of it, I've been told that to use this to use this product. So what this is, is T-Cut, um, and it's a color restorer for black, and it says it's for all shades of black. So I thought, why not? It's a couple of quid. We'll get it, we'll review it, and we'll hopefully it'll work. If it doesn't, then obviously I can let you guys know so you don't make the same mistake as what I will. But hopefully it fixes our issues. I've got a couple of scratches by the front as well, so if it works on this one on the side, then I might try it out on that as well. So, so yeah, leave me feedback down below on if you want to see any more of these sorts of review types, any more products you want me to try, leave that all down below so I can sort of purchase them, buy them, review them, whatever. Um, also, let me know if, you're, if you prefer today's video because I'm actually using my camera rather than my iPhone, which I've been doing for the last couple of videos. So yeah, it's a bit more bigger and bulky, but if the quality is a lot better, then I'm happy to keep using it. So, so yeah, please let me know down below if you think it's better so yeah without further ado let me show you the scratch please remember to like comment and subscribe down below please ding dong that notification bell as well just so you keep updated on when i upload uh, we're going for sort of like an every sunday upload schedule at the moment um, i'm thinking about doing maybe sort of a wednesday thursday upload um, every now and then as well just to sort of keep the videos going because i'm really enjoying this at the moment i'm really into my cars at the moment uh, but i've just purchased a load of stuff so we can actually do a quite a big video I think um, in the future so hopefully that will go well um, and hope you enjoy that one but yeah all will be revealed later on so yeah let's get into the video It's probably a bit bright out here because the sun's out for once in England, so I probably look even more pacey than what I actually am. But yeah, couldn't really get it in shot. The scratch is along here, and that's the one we're going to be trying to fix. I mean, and like I've said before, I've never done this before, never used a product before, so hopefully it all goes well. Hopefully it gets the scratch out. The sun's coming out even more now. Uh, let me hide behind it. There we go. And uh, yeah, hopefully we can uh, get it fixed. I'll show you the other scratches quickly. A bit scratched up. I don't know if it's where from the stones have flicked it or what. But yeah, a bit scratched. So the pressure washer didn't get it off. So that's what we're going to try and get off today as well. We have another scuff here. This is like it when I bought the car. Um, I don't know where that's been done. But yeah, like I said, knees getting rid of. It's probably the biggest one on the car. Um, apart from that, everything else looks all right. Yeah, this is actually the biggest one, sorry. Yeah, we've got this one as well. This was like it when I bought the car. Someone's obviously scraped it against something. So, yeah, we need to fix that one as well. So hopefully this T-Cut does the job. So yeah, they're the four or five bits we need to fix. Hopefully this T-Cut does the job. Hopefully we can get them fixed and make the car looking all sweet. But yeah, let's get into it. Apply. Rub, remove. Pretty straightforward. Cool, so the first one we're gonna do is this one here. It's probably the most obvious one. Um, it says use sparingly, so sure.
tools. So we just use the first lot. My hands are black again. Um, same as every other video, really. And uh, it's done all right. I would say it's not done the best. Um, so, it has some scratches sort of like along this bit. It's got rid of these ones a little bit. Like, it hasn't really, the deeper ones here and here, it's made them a bit more lighter, but it hasn't really buffed them out like I thought it would. guys you probably won't be able to see that but pretty much taking it out pretty much got it all there's still a little bit there that you can see if you got up close but far away it looks all sorted all right time for the next one then we've got this one here and a bit around here to do and that's just dirt to be there So again, it hasn't taken all of it off. Obviously, where you've got the wear and tear and stuff on the actual surface, it won't take that off. But the actual colour itself, pretty sorted out. So the sun's right in my face right now, but I just want to try doing this one again because with the front two, it's sort of cleared up the colour, but it hasn't cleared up obviously like the, the surface damage, which I can live with that because it was like a couple of quid. Um, this one, when I first done it, when I first done it, it didn't take out the colour, it's still silver or like grey colour, like where it's been marked. So what I'm gonna do is go over it again, um, see if it works. If it doesn't, I'll let you know. If it does, I'll let you know. Overall, a couple of quid, not bad. Let's do it. taken some of the color out but this one is still there is the colors not going down it's taking the edges off like the, like the, um, the more thinner parts but the actual thick bit is still there uh, the one over here is still there that one was quite deep but the two here and here they seem to have disappeared so that's all good cool so I'm back in my car now um, after this quick little video um, I've buffed out most of the scratches obviously the ones that i show you that were, weren't coming out couldn't get to which a bit of a shame really i thought it was actually going to get a little bit deeper than what it did obviously i know it's not like a miracle gel that will just get rid of any scratch and whatnot but at least thought it would change the color on most of it um the little scratches it did perform really well on so i can't really fault the product for that i mean it says it's removed scratches it did remove the scratches for the little side of things 
Um, also with like the colour, change the colour, it did what it said on the tin, change the colour of it. Just a little bit disappointed about obviously the thick scratch on the side, so the front ones are okay, there's a couple of little marks left, but it got rid of the majority of it, which I'm happy with. It's just that one on the side which I really want to get rid of, that's the one that didn't come out. Um, which sucks, but I guess you live and you learn, so yeah, do I like this product? I mean, yeah, it does what it says on the tin. Um, will I use it again? Probably, yeah. If I had like minor scratches, then yeah, I'd definitely use it. It's just with those bigger ones, obviously, I'm going to need to try and find something a little bit more stronger, a little bit better, just to try and get those ones out. But for what it is, a couple of quid, it did the job on most of it. It made it all look a bit more fresher. So yeah, it done, it done the job, kind of. What would I rate it out of 10? Probably around a seven. Like, I'd get it again for the smaller scratches. So that's why I've rated it sort of above average. But for the, I wouldn't give it like an eight or a nine just for the fact that for the bigger scratches it might not work or it won't work. That's why I've sort of rated it a seven. So a little bit above average. Yeah, I'd buy it, but I wouldn't use it on everything if that makes sense. So yeah, rating the product overall, seven out of 10. And that's what I'm gonna go with. But yeah, if you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe. Obviously, we're trying to do a few new things on the channel. We've got a couple of things coming uh, in the future, as I mentioned earlier, like car reviews. Um, obviously, we've got to do some more mods to the car, make it look a bit nicer. Uh, we'll go out and do a few things as well, which is all good. So we'll get that sort of going over the next couple of weeks. Like I say, weekly uploads every Sunday at 8pm. And then maybe during the week, we'll do it for two uploads a week as well, because... I want to bring you guys content. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you thought of the video. Let you know what you thought of tea cut in general. Uh, we're gonna do a couple of maybe wraps and stuff, um, like how to wrap, um, how to de-chrome, things like that. Um, I won't be doing the wrapping because I'm bad at it, but one of my mates is good at it, so we'll let him play around with, the, with my car. We might do a few bits of his cars, do a bit of collabs with him. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. A like rating will also be appreciated down below. And please remember to subscribe if you want to see more content. Ding on that notification bell as well. Um, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.